Hey what's going on guys it's Moon here and today I've got my Russian League squad squad builder and we'll get straight off with the start with our goalkeeper who is Akinfev just if you haven't noticed already I'm playing the 4 on 2 on 2 formation Akinfev is going to cost you about a thousand coins but he is a top top class goalkeeper one of the best in ultimate team up with their likes of Steckenberg and Neuer so our left back is going to be oh just uh, excuse me for some of the pronunciations of these I, I think Ansaladi 800 coins he's going to cost you. He's a good centre-back. 88 pace. He does keep up well with the faster players in the game. Our first centre-back, our first gold centre-back is going to be the first one of the informs. Bocchetti. Bocchetti, I think I pronounced that right. Not too bad. 20,000 coins he's going to cost you because centre-backs in the Russian league aren't that sort of re readily available. So he's going to cost you a bit of money. He's a good solid centre-back as well. And Bruno Alves in form. If you're wondering about getting him, Look at that, 90 heading and 82 defending, don't get him, he's crap, he is rarely poor, he's a poor defender. This is in my opinion guys, don't hate on me because you've got a Russian League team and you love him. I love my MLS team, Silver team, and people hate that, so I, I don't think Bruno Alves is worth anywhere near 16,000 coins, I'm sorry about that, but he's just not worth it. Our right back is, an, yeah, he's Russian anyway, plays for St. Petersburg and he's going to cost you 1,400 coins. Sometimes I'm just not even going to attempt to pronounce that name. I should really know how to pronounce it, but I'm not. So our centre defensive mid is Roberto Carlos. Again, 4 on 2 on 2 formation, so adds to the chemistry. He's going to cost you about 2,000 coins. He's got an amazing free kick on him. He's a brilliant player in this team. He's really good in that centre defensive mid position. Not usually, I think everyone was used to him being a left back. But he's really good in that position. And as I said, one hell of a free kick. Our left mid is Toshik. He's got 91 pace, you can see there, and 85 dribbling. He's going to cost you about 1,200 coins, give or take 200 odd coins there. But he is another very fast player. I think he's better than Dustak, du Dustak, whatever. And he's um, he plays in the left mid position. He's on the bench, as you see in a minute. Our right mid is McGeevy, who moved, I think he moved this year to the Russian League or the year before from Celtic to, I think, something moscow and he's right mid five star skill moves as you probably all know 1500 coins and very pacey as well nice 89 pace and 87 dribbling so he's a good winger there our center attack mid is danny again he's he's really good he's got a fantastic long shot on him there 83 pace 81 passing 86 dribbling so a very good player all around it's going to cost you about 2000 coins our first striker is kershikov you see there, 87 pace and 82 shots, so good all round. He's got, I, I got him by now, 800 coins in the 4-4-2 four, 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 formation, so that's how cheap he's going, so I'm just putting him down for 800 coins. Now, this is the most expensive player in the team. i am got to say, Eto. I had him in FIFA 11, and he was brilliant. He's awful in FIFA 12. Don't get him, guys. If just He's awful for me. He's nowhere near an 88 He's n good job he's in the Russian league and only cost 45,000 because I will be gutted if I bought him the way he's played for me or the way I've played with him it just doesn't suit my style of play he's not my type of player and that's why I don't like him but the starting 11 cost will be 91,700 it is it is you think other oh, Russian league's meant to be cheap it's because the informs are netto but obviously you'll see from the bench you can get very cheap players to replace those informs obviously you can get the, the the normal version of the card, not the informs. Now, our spare centre-back is Parisia, and he costs about 450 coins. We have two silver players in this team. Left-back, see, 82 pace there. He, he costs you about 1,500 coins. And our right-back again, silver, 84 pace. He's going to cost you about 1,500 coins. They're actually quite good. You can get some good silver Russian league players. I know there's a bit of silver in there. He costs about 6,000 coins, but I haven't got him in this team. Our space centre defensive mid is Denedson, Denezov, and he costs you about 500 coins, very, very cheap, especially in the 4 on 2 on 2 formation. And Dujdak, he costs you about 800 coins. Again, he's got good all round stats, though, as you can see there. He's actually a really good player. I just like Tossic because he's small and he just seems really, really fast. And I, I like pacey players, to be honest. Now, Beresloff, he costs you about 1,000 coins. In the 4 on 2 on 2 formation, so he's another very cheap player. Another very fast player as well, 94 pace there. Honda, who's another brilliant player, got a fantastic free kick and he got a very good left foot. Good all round stats there, and he's going to cost you about 1,500 coins. Now, our three spare strikers are Doombia, Wagnerlove, and Wellington. 
don't get Doombia or Wellington. The only one I'd recommend to get out of them is Vagnalov. I don't like either of them. Vagnalov is okay. He's just not that good either. But Doombia is 2,800. He's got a good all-round stats, but just doesn't play like it. Vagnalov is going to cost you about 2,000 coins. And Wellington's just crap. And he's going to cost you about 3,000 coins. 92 pace. He has not got that, I tell you that. He really hasn't got that. And Eto, I think he's got... He's a 93 pace, he doesn't act like it at all. After that little rant, the start and the price for the whole squad is 100,000 and what 100,000 power 100,000 coins about sort of something around that area. Um, I definitely not recommend to get this squad, but you can have a go with it. It's cheap to make if you're not buying the informs or say Eto. So, hopefully, you did enjoy this video, guys. I'm probably a bit down on this video because this team I haven't really enjoyed, but hopefully, you did enjoy it. Hopefully. Give the video a like if you think it deserves it, and I'll see you guys later.